and you think it's going to fix. I had hair transplants. Yeah. And I had my first one, I think, when I was like 26. I had three of them. Why? And, Why so young? Just because you were Because my, my hair was falling out. I was fucking <laughs> sh- freaking out. I was freaking out when my hair was falling out because I was on TV, too. Mm. And I was making a, a living, like, as right. an actor at the time on news radio. And I was like, oh, my God, my fucking hair is falling out. I had knew, knew it was falling out for a while. I saved it, though, with the minoxidil. And the minoxidil was hanging in there. But after a while, it was like it was still falling out. And I was like, God, I got to do something about it. I should have never done anything. I should have shaved my head from the beginning. And so whenever kids ask me online, like dudes ask me, oh, I'm fucking freaking out. I'm only 18. I'm losing my hair. Shave it, bitch. Just yeah. deal with that. Just just accept the fact that you don't have any hair. Did the because hair plugs it, look bad? It didn't look good. Yeah. My ne- like I never looked at my hair and went, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was always like, like, oh, I guess I got hair up there now, whatever. But, it, you know, the, the way they do it is like a single mm-hmm. thing. You know, like it's not like the old way of doing it. But they take it, big strip of hair. So I have this like big scar in the back of my head like a smile for the rest of my <laughs> life but i'd rather have that like first of all it's a good public service announcement like if you're thinking about doing this just look at my head don't do it just shave your head and then the other thing is that it it's it's almost like what you're doing is it's a screwball thing like it seems like it might work a little but then as you start doing it, you go why wait a minute isn't there options isn't there another op-? and the other option is just let it be what the fuck it is and stop freaking yeah. out. That's the other option. There's always the best option rather than getting knocked unconscious and they take a chunk of meat out of the back of your head and drill fucking holes yeah, in there and insane. implant those. It's nuts. Jason, oh, yeah. Jason, what's his name? Jason Alex, Jason Alexander, I think. Yeah. He, yeah, he, he wanted to go back in time just wow. like 10 years. So yeah. it kind of looked like he was about to go bald. See, why would just you? Just to make it more realistic. Wow. Yeah, he got... um. He got like a super cool hairpiece, I guess. Yeah. It's kind of weird because like if a chick wears a wig, it's like, you know, no biggie, you know? Like like right. when Madonna would wear right. wigs or when Lady Gaga would wear some crazy wigs, like n- nobody tripped. But if a dude's wearing a wig, there's something. <laughs> 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 yeah, hey, whatever, man. That's what the dude wants to look like. But for me, I can tell you that it was a big mistake on my part and it was one that I made in getting hair transplants out of insecurity because I was young. And I was, you know, thinking like, oh, I'm not going to have a career. I'm going to be a bald loser. You know, like that's what I was thinking. That's what society drills into us. Yeah, and if you and if you want to have a solution to something, you go research it. And at the time, I always, there's very little internet, too, so it wasn't as easy to research things. Mm-hmm. But, you know, you talk to, you find like a doctor who does it, and you talk to them, and they, they show you photos, and you're like, oh, this is going to work. Oh, whew. Boy, I'm going to fix my hair. And the next thing you know, you're like, what am I doing? This stupid fuck. And I guarantee you... Oh, Probably most women that wind up doing something wrong, whether it's a lip thing or a nose thing, where they're like, oh, Christ. And they look at it in the mirror and they're like, what the fuck did I just do?